Yo, what up, everybody? It's PSI. Welcome to another video. So today, I uh, topped locals, finally. Um, there was 24 players. I got fifth place. Uh, four rounds. I went X1. Um, I faced Blue Eyes. Um, then, uh, that, their ending board is insane. Uh, he actually got game one. Um, it was like Spear Dragon, uh, which stops your Gamma, because you can't special summon two monsters. Um, Harbinger, Seal Bounce, and then, like, he Leviathan ripped a card from my hand, so that was insane, but I got him in games two and three. Um, then I faced Altergeist, uh, he bricked twice. Rest in peace, Nathaniel. Um, then I played Adrian, um, he was playing, um, like, uh, uh, Phantom Night, Burning Abyss, uh, I just, I couldn't play through it. Like, that, that end board is crazy, too. Um, and then finally, uh, I faced Emmanuel. He was playing Drytron. Uh, he kind of bricked. Uh, he ended on a couple negates, but Dragon Link is too strong. So uh, for my fifth place win, I got three packs. So let's open up some packs. All right, we got Armor Dragon Ritual, uh, Dogmatica card, uh, Metal Foes, S Force. We got an Ultra Rare, the Window Witch Ultra Rare. Nice. Spriggan's Fabled Treason. I don't think I've ever gotten that one before. All right, next pack. Uh -huh. uh, one of the rituals. Let's see. We got a super rare Armed Dragon Thunder level 3. Nice. Okay. Last pack before the deck profile. Okay, Thunder Dragon card, Metal Foes, that thing. Our super Rare is a Ultra Rare Live Twin Leela Treat. So we got two Ultra Rares, nice. I didn't know they made a zombie one. Um, and then this stuff. All right, enough of that. Let's take a look at the profile. So I cut it down to 42. Because um, consistency. I couldn't, I, I tried to cut two more cards, but I could not, and then also fit the Dragoon package. Oh yeah, I'm back on Dragoon in 42. I did draw the Red Eyes, but like, every other deck is so much weaker now that you don't care if you draw the Bricks, so it ended up working out. Um, so, Double Starly Safer, pretty good card. Only two Rocket Tracer, I don't think I've ever played only two. I'd have to look back at old profiles. One Recharger, Double Rocket Synchron, you absolutely need two, guys, like... You drawing this with World Legacy Guard Dragon is full combo because of Needle Fiber. Like, you need to have that in deck, though. Um, you used to play the Red Rose back when Link Cross was legal, and then Phalanx as well. So you need other level 3 or lower tuners in your deck that are Dragon Monsters. So you run two of that. Uh, and then finally, Rocket, um, uh, or Absarada Dragon. Then the one-ofs. Um, one Brotar, one Black Metal. It feels weird not playing three of this. Uh, one... Uh, parlor <laughs> i don't have dragon chambers uh but this is cool it could be uh, a, a starter and then like i don't know just don't just get the chambers um white and black nocto vision this card is insane um levioneer red eyes darkest Smile. then the hand traps now i'm doing something more reasonable main decking to lancia triple ash blossom and joyous spring and triple gamma with the driver. So, cool combo uh, that I did on the Blue Eyes player. Uh, he normal summoned the Sage with Eyes of Blue in game three, and I gammaed, and then he set two back row and passed. So it end phased Lancia, um, and uh, I got to keep my gamma and driver, and I got to start my turn off with Needle Fiber, just free, free. <laughs> Love that combo. Finally, for the monsters, the other two bricks, Dark Magician and Red Eyes, Black Dragon. So, on to the spell cards. So, we got the one Red Eyes Fusion. Uh, you know what I actually ended up doing a lot? Um, I cited out the Dragoon package. Like, a lot. Um, it was weird. Uh, but I, I heard that you could do that online. And... Um, I tried it and it worked. Like I didn't see the bricks. I got it, it gives you more room for hand traps. I guess it's like kind of like playing an upstart goblin, because dragoon's not going to be um, your priority for every game. It's good to have it in game one so that they fear the predator plant Vertanaconda. 
Like sometimes you just summon Verte so that it can get reacted to. Um, honestly, some people play the Verte without playing the Dragoon package at all, just because Verte like demands a response unless you have effect negation. So, uh, one for one, uh, great extender. I drew that in Absor Outer Dragon. Game over. This with Absor Outer Dragon is also gasoline cast base. Uh, the triple uh, World Legacy Guard Dragon, the triple Quick Launch, still running through that. Uh, the one boot, the one field spell, and the two tidying. You don't need chambermaid to play tidying. Still really good. Extra deck, Nibiru token, Dragoon, uh, Borla Savage. One, two, three striker dragons. Elpy, Pisty, two heavenly spheres, very important. Proud Plant Verte Anaconda is back in business. Romulus, Christian Hockey Fibrex, Apollosa, this comes up. Saryuja, MV fucking P. Love that card. And Boral Sword. Actually, I did not summon Boral Sword today. I didn't need it. That's so crazy. But Boral Sword is absolutely mandatory. You must play it. Do not try to cut it. Um, shout out Team Bad Cards, baby. Let's take a look at that side deck. So, uh, Triple Nib, this is amazing. Um, I don't I guess it's not main deck worthy anymore because, I mean, Dragon Link just plays through it. They summon the... They, they end on their board anyway. So, just side this in for, like, uh, your uh, other matches, like PK Burning Abyss, I guess. Um, triple Phantasme. Now, this is really good against Dragon Link, um, and it's also good against most decks now because the, the ones that didn't uh, Link summon like Virtual World, are essentially gone. Even Altergeist Link summons when they summon Link Rebo and stuff. Uh, the third Lancey is on the side, just for those Dino players. Like, you, you gotta... Like, even if you can Phantasmate into a Lancia and then stop the Conductor from coming, like, it's better than nothing. Like, oof, gosh. Uh, triple Dark Ruler. This is mainly for, like, Windows and stuff. Like, you hold it, and then you try to play, and then they Schism you, and then you... Dark Ruler them, because I don't have Droplets. If I had Droplets, these would be Droplets. I might even main deck them if there were Droplets. Feather Duster, uh, it's a one. You could play it, so... Cosmic, because Banishing is better than Popping. And I don't like to discard. Um, and one Red Reboot. So, yeah, I went over the matches already. Uh, but, yeah, I'm pretty satisfied with this deck. Um, against Adrian, um, when I used my Heretic Seal of Heavenly S S uh, Spheres, I misplayed it, and I summoned... Uh, a phantasme off of it when I should have summoned literally any extender, um, and then I would have been able to to do something because um, he ended his turn. I had Nibiru on field and no cards in hand, and I drew for turn and it was a chaos space, so I ended up losing because of that. Um, so yeah, that's my bad. I just got to be better as a player. But I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video, um, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Subscribe, like, comment, and yeah.